looking for a way to turn off comments on your WordPress site? My name is Victoria and in today's video I'll show you how to do just that. Any website owner will agree that comments can be useful for increasing user engagement, but there are good reasons why you might want to disable comments on WordPress. For starters, comments can contain spam messages, phishing links, or even fake complaints from your competitors. These types of comments can damage your reputation, especially if you're building a business site or an e-commerce store. Luckily, turning off the comment section on WordPress is easy, as long as you know the right steps. In this video, you will learn five different ways to disable comments directly from the WordPress dashboard. Let's start with the first one. Before turning off WordPress comments, you will need to audit all existing posts and pages to find unwanted messages. From your WordPress admin area, head to Comments. You will find it in the left menu. Select all comments you want to remove by ticking the checkboxes next to them. Once that's done, choose Move to Trash from the drop-down menu and click Apply. At this point, all unwanted comments have been removed from your WordPress site but the WordPress comment form still allows people to leave new comments. To disable the WordPress comment form, navigate to Posts and select All Posts. Then select All Posts by ticking the checkbox next to Title. Click the Bulk Actions drop-down menu, choose Edit and hit Apply. Locate the Comments section and change the status to Do Not Allow. Don't forget to click Update to save your changes. To turn off comments on Pages, go to Pages and select All Pages. The rest of the process is pretty much the same. While the first method helps you turn off comments on existing pages and posts, visitors can still post comments on future articles. Thankfully, you can easily prevent this by navigating to Settings and choosing Discussion. Next to Default Post Settings, uncheck the option that says Allow people to submit comments on new posts. Make sure to click Save Changes once you are done. You may want to disable comments only on specific posts or pages. In that case, the steps are similar to the first method. Instead of selecting all posts, tick only the checkboxes of relevant articles or pages. After that, select Edit, click Apply and set comments to Do Not Allow. Finally, hit Update to save the changes. We have talked about disabling comments in bulk but it's also possible to turn off a single post or page's comments. However, please know that this method will override your site-wide settings. In other words, this will only apply to an individual article or page you choose. Now, let me show you the steps. First, click Edit below your intended post or page. Find the Discussion section on the right side panel once you are in the Gutenberg or Classic Editor. Unselect Allow Comments and click either Update or Publish. If you can't find the Discussion section in the editor, head back to the WordPress dashboard and again go to your intended post or page. This time around, select Quick Edit to uncheck the Allow Comments option. Using a plugin is a good alternative if you prefer a quicker way to turn off comments on WordPress. However, note that by using this method, your individual post settings will not work anymore. I will use the Disable Comments plugin for this tutorial. First, you'll need to install the plugin by navigating to Plugins, clicking Add New and searching for Disable Comments. Click Install Now, wait a few moments and hit Activate. Then hover over Settings and you'll find the plugin name at the bottom. On the plugin's interface, there are two settings options. Under Disable Comments, choose Everywhere to turn off all comments from your site. Alternatively, select On Specific Post Types option to turn off comments only on posts, pages, or media. Under Delete Comments, you can find several options to remove existing comments. So, have you successfully disabled comments on your WordPress site? Let us know which method works best for you. And if you found this tutorial helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Hosting Your Academy for more WordPress tutorials. Thank you for watching and good luck on your online journey.